everybody and welcome back for another game we need to try. Today we are returning back to Wayfinder. Uh, this is the day that is officially will be re-released uh, re <laughs> after like year or something the day they tried to make MMORPG uh, but in the end after a lot of things that happened and you will find a lot of those information right uh, out there uh, they decided to change uh, the game from MMORPG to ARPG so we uh, are heading into the dungeon and I will show you the combat so this is a single player experience that you can you can see this game is absolutely gorgeous and uh, yeah and I, I want to experience it right away because when it was originally released to um, to early access as a MMORPG there was some issues right um, uh, but maybe as a, as an ARPG that for a single player or co-op you can play with the friends maybe everything will work out so much better I don't know so let's go for shadow imbuement uh, codex halls so that means that we will be running uh, procedurally generated dungeon codex halls and we will be mutating it with gloom touch so everything should like explode after the, it will die something like that and we will playing the character you have several characters to choose from uh, uh, start with three and then you can unlock more and you can change their weapons and the weapons uh, changing hold their like kit how they play so um, here we are in the codex halls Don't and be afraid. yeah there is a story and everything unlock a uh, wingrave memory all right let's check it out we are wingrave we playing is wingrave right now so let's let's do it hold to give them items and how wingrave show mercy please I'm sorry, Loras, but the light will be your judge. What is this? Blood on my sword. The monks, what could have possessed me turn? All right, so maybe this guy who was uh, like light figure is not dead light. Oh, look at him. Look at him. He wasn't to jump to me, but nope. Nope, sir. All right, should, should we go and, and try it? All right, that was... <laughs> That was great. That was awesome. All right, let's activate this, and they should, uh, you know, spawn around. Hopefully. All right, here we here they come. So we got two-handed axe. So we will be doing some damage to them, and when they die. All right, we got some abilities to use. All right, let's move out of the situation. We still have the Q as our uh, like damaging abilities from our weapon. Okay, can we taunt them? That will give me a life steal. All right, one more shooting guy. Do we have it? Pick up a tracer. Nice. Let me see one more thing because I feel that it's really loud. It's goddamn really loud. So let's go and move it to the 40% 40, uh, 40 area and maybe that will solve every issue whatsoever. Uh, so we need to go up, please. Thank you. And I want to, you know, uh, reach that place. Good, because they will be... That, there might be something good. Alright, we broke his armor and now we can work. Oh no, I messed it up. <laughs> I wanted to move out of the situation, but I died instead. Or at least I'll get damage. Yeah, we need this. Woohoo! Nice! Open the big chest, small chest. Oh, mimic! Perfect. All right, really cute mimic. Taunt it. No. Stop it. Stop it, sir. And let's cue him. That will be big damage. Thousand damage for your ass. All right, let's, let's move away. Q is up. Oh, ouch, ouch. What are you doing? Let's go. All right. Be farming. New weapon skin. Hm. So let's move with this handle and we will open. 
Okay, we, I think, experienced everything there. So we should continue. Oh, there is a resource. Shadow Warp Spectra. If we will die, we will open, uh, get to this point. Open the door. Use skeleton key. We have some, so that's good. Oh, nice, new armor. Let's go check it out, the new armor. Character and no style. We don't want style, we get uh, new armor. So, break power. This is max health and ability power. And this is ability power and break power. I think I like what I have right now. So that that's fine. It would be great to get a new, um, like, axe, for example. But you know what? We can't be pickers. We need to f focus on advancement and then we will find something cool. Oh, whoa, 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 Th this hurts. Th this, this dot trap, when he hit, hitting you, but what the hell? There's a lot of traps. <laughs> and I'm just dodging those traps and yeah, I don't even care. I'm just running around and dodging the, the traps. <laughs> What a lucky person. Okay. Oh, that, uh, that is a mistake. Okay, I'm fine. <laughs> I'm fine. <laughs> Alright, can I get out of there? That, that's the question. Can I roll? Hell yeah. Hell yeah, we survived. Even though that was supposed to be our death. Like, you know, because we were behind. Alright, we will do it like this. That's beautiful. What is that? Chest of the Trickster. Okay, alright. What do we have? Are you feeling lucky? So we can open one. And uh, let's go with this one. First one. That's a shame. Try again. Alright, he will switch them up. So let's go for the... This one. Perfect. Congratulations, you won big prize. Oh, should I go with another one? No, 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 no. All right, we won, we won. Beautiful. Okay, so, hello. Good, good sir. Get away from me, slimy bastard. Oh, that was, uh, that was good. We just destroy them, our axes. Whole different level. Okay. We got this. We got this. Alright, resource to farm. And spiders coming. Oh my god, a lot of things happening here. Oh, this is no nice. Get out and kill him. Ouch. Zenith Rider Boots for Senja. So for different characters, we are getting those armors. Oh, nice. Traps, traps everywhere. Oh, Varys, who is that? Varys, amazing uh, accountants. Oh, we don't, we have six. So I can't buy, what do I want? Hmm. For example, this looks really cool. All right, nothing. We'll keep you to it, sir. It's kind of cool that all the cosmetics they they supposed to have for a, for a MTX shop, right? The, for a microtransactions, uh, they reintroduce to to um to loot tables, right? So you can find everything. What they have prepared for like uh, free to play game. So now you will buy it once and you have everything. So there is quite a lot of like things that you can go with. Nice. Just Killing those small bastards. Wretches. Ouch. Heralds. Okay. Bang, big bang. Gloom ambush completed. Let's continue forward. Oh my god, what the hell? Let's destroy the cube. Do we have something cool? No? It's just... It was just a cube. Cute cube. Alright, well, we have it. My light goes dim. Okay. I didn't see this one. 
traps are bad for your life. For your healthy appearance and everything. So it's better to, to avoid them if, if it's possible. Yeah. You can't kill, like die many times because uh, you are losing the track on top of the screen. And after that, you will lose some, uh, some, uh, you know, some rewards at the end. So, I don't want to die anymore. That's embarrassing. Alright, we, we explore this. Bang. Goblin is... D what the hell? He didn't have any HP. Maybe he fell from somewhere. Oh, nice. Circle for eternity. Those things are great. They are giving a lot of power. Oh, oh, I see you this time around. Run, 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 run. Oh, there is a no, no, Senja. We don't have the Senja, so we can't see that, that story. All right, let's go. Let's go finish this dungeon. Mysterious is silent. A silent. What the hell? Let's get away. Oh yeah, that, that's the monk from the monastery, it seems. All right, we need we need to break him fast. Get behind me. Oh, I didn't want to do that just yet. That was a mistake. The silver codex stands. All right, he's broken, so that's good. Big damage from behind. Okay. Let's go for the shield. Big swing. Oh. He's bigger. Ah, he dodged. How is that possible? Uh, he can do those things. That's only me that I can dodge. Oh, I broke him. <laughs> he can't do his little thingy. Alright, the taunt is kind of like useless because I got full HP, so... And I'm the only one who is here. Ouch! That was nasty. But you dead. Sir, you dead. Alright! Okay, so we looted something and we need to return in there to NPC. And she will tell us what it is. And I feel... What the hell? Look at that. All right, let's kill it with with our trusty dagger. Bang, and we finished the dungeon. All right, so we got everything, I think. Oh, nice, Typhoon. I kind of like that. The, the two-handed axe so far, the best weapon for me. But you can you can go with the with the weapon with the shotgun. I think there is the sword and board. There is there is like eight weapons. So scythe is there. Yeah, there's quite a lot of so you are combining like hero and also um a weapon so character collection for example i got four heroes i got the wingrave sniss silo and kairos i would love to try kairos as well and then this uh, sencha uh venomous and also uh what is this grendel oh yeah grendel so those are the heroes and you have several weapons that you can choose from so we looted a new axe is that right? But maybe it will be absolutely the same that we have. 277. Yeah, I feel it, it, it's the, uh, unfortunately it's the same weapon. <laughs> All right. Uh, we got the, um, the artifacts. 63, but we can't have it because we already have this. So, nope. Nothing kinda useful. Alright, let's go return back. The unfortunate Lord Halar was among Walking the shadows. It worked. Shadow is the strongest element within the gloom, but I've never seen it as strong as in this zone. What's next? We need to stop the beacon's light from fading at any cost. Without it, the darkness would consume us all. I'm beginning to suspect the gloom is more than just a force. There may be something out there, something driving it. What you found mm. in Aurelian proves that the Silver Codex was manipulating these forces decades before the fall. Their work may hold the answers we need. What about the stranger? Seen these before. The monks used them to store information. 
This is the journal of a Codex initiate named Azarin. He writes about efforts to achieve immortality, to reshape the world. Always the mortality is the problem. This was done deeper in Aurelian, in what Azarin calls the Undercroft. But only those who passed the trial of lingering light could enter the Undercroft. And he never did. We've never found a path beyond the Codex halls. But if you could complete this trial, it might give you a connection to the Undercroft. We have to know what they were doing. Alright, how I can complete it this trial. Exists somewhere in the echoes of the Codex Halls. There must be some record of it. Alright, so we are going for the record. I wish there was another option. Since the Gloomfall, we've had to put our pasts behind us. Wolf and the Huntmaster were once bitter enemies. But in the face of the gloom, we have to work together. So it is with Kestrel and I. All right, continue. You know what? Let's continue, shall we? Because uh, yeah, there is a lot of story behind it, so you can uh, you can listen to all those uh, dialogues and everything. But we are on the time issue, and we need to explore a little bit more of the game because there is there is quite a lot, right? You have this. This is the starting zone, and uh, when I go like view map, you can go to the highlands. This is like open map kind of thing and you are unlocking new things and uh, for example codex halls right right but you will unlock more of those dungeons and everything so that is quite a lot and they added a new zone that i had never been into and is big, bigger than everything be uh, from before yeah you know what we are searching for the for someone right i mean distress beacon I mean, Travel to Highlands. Yeah, let's do that. So, you know what? We can actually go to the Highlands like this. And, uh, you know what? We will uh, go to the Great Lift. Just immediately. Because i already been in Highlands, so I have a few of those portals. Alright. Can we manage to get that through the loading screen? I don't know. But... So far, the game they, the game is kind of fun. Like the progression, yeah, we, we will not talk about anything, right? So you can experience the story yourself, if you want. The game is out now, like, uh, today it should be released. And it should work like 25 bucks or something like that, if I, if I uh, remember correctly. Uh, and it will be like single player thing and if uh, people will uh, at least what developers said that uh, they, they had two choices right to shut down the game forever just yeah it is it is what it is uh, and just it go away or they, they put more time into it to transform into single player and and you know uh, make it like the people would be able to play it and they decided this and this is kind of cool all right so so we found the castrel that's nice this connection will prove useful train tracks God's blood so we need to go here all right let's do it Do, 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 200. So this is like open world. There are some some scavengers or some uh, some faction. Look at them. And we are looking for what exactly? Something else? Are we in the wrong spot? Are we going there from the other side? Oh yes, we do. We need to go out of the city. Oh look at that! The game. I, I absolutely from the first point I saw the 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 game, like when it was, it was supposed to be MMO, uh, and they showed me how the game looks. I, I feel it's it's unique. The art style is really like cartoony, but kind of like really I don't know. It got something special about it. At least uh, I feel I feel like that. Ouch! Why are you slashing me? I done nothing. No, I don't have uh, stamina. I don't want to fight them. Not fair. Okay, we we waiting for stamina. We don't need to fight them, right? We are looking for the pit, or for the for the thing. All right, level six. We are over it. Where is the thing? Oh, we are absolutely wrong spot. <laughs> but I see that there is a teleportation stone. Is that right? So I will keep. Uh, I will take the teleportation stone. Yes. There is work to be done. Sir. 
are you trying to do? Oh, nice. We are level 10. That's huge. Miss. <laughs> Puny Wayfinder. Puny Wayfinder. So, uh... Where is the where is the continuation? I feel that after this we will go into the dungeon, uh, but different one than from before. So it's kind of like yeah, I want to show you the different dungeon before we will we will uh, you know wrap it up. Is that a thing? How to get there? It's supposed. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. see, see, see. I see now. All right. Oh, here you go. Ah, requires Grendel. Well, there you are, love. You've got the connection. Now go to the pit and see what you can find. Nice. And now we are going to the dungeon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I played this when it was uh, in early access, this this bit, so I kind of remember. But it's like one year or one, I don't know, some something like that. So it's quite a while I played this game. And now we, uh, what, now we have what it takes to go into the pit. So let's do it. All right, select destination. We are going to the pit and we will go and uh, imbue it flora. I don't know if we are able, I think we should be able to make it happen. So let's go in. And they added some difficulties beyond the, the end game. So when you finish the story and follow everything, there are like uh, diff different tiers of the dungeons and everything. So you are going mythic and something and you will be like, you know, scaling those dungeons go. and and go beyond. There is a boss fight are there. there is, I don't know, there is a lot. Abilities, so we can upgrade one of our abilities. That's nice. I'm using this one quite a lot and this one. I like those two the most. So, Radiant Pulse sends out multiple smaller pulses damage throughout this duration. I like that. And increase damage reduction while using Righteous Dryer. Mm, no. Let's go with level 2 here. More pulses. It's kind of cool. Echoes. Yeah, those echoes is that uh, we don't have any echo. Those echoes is upgrading your, your stuff. Like that those are giving you a lot of power and specialization. So we need to find them. Ugh, Flora. Poison. Ugh. We don't like that. Oh my god. So yeah, th those are the things that you are imbued in the dungeon with. So that's changing what are you fighting against. Oh, uh, can we go away? <laughs> yep. Alright, healing please. Healing, please, good sir. Let's taunt them, because if they are taunted and I'm slashing their... Ouch. Goblin. What is that? He's just standing inside all those things. Thank you, Windfinder. At least something. Nice. But the poison is not nice. Okay. We've done it. Open the chest. Typhoon 11. All right, we have to check it out because we got a Typhoon 9, right? I think with this one, oh, holy moly, 240. That's so good. Because now, um, yeah, we, we changed this, but now we have two echoes that we can insert. And we will insert it from the things that we used it before. This one, right? Resilience and physical defense. Already equipped. And this one, Brood Mother, triggered by losing half your guard bar meter. Yes. All right. So we switched. So now it should be uh, better than before, right? Three hundred one, and this one, just weapon power is better. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Perfectly fine. Perfectly fine. And there is a lot of systems that I have not even like reached to, to really find out what, what they are. They, they introduced the whole talent system in the, in the single player because that was not... Oh no! Yeah, with E you are going against the, the guard, the yellow meter, and with normal slashes you are going against the HP. 
That's that's what it is. Each weapon got like different approaches. Like uh, some of the weapons are really good at breaking, like the armor. Some of them are not. For example, daggers are good against the health, right? But if they are, have armor, you have like a harder time to get through that. Oh, mimic again! God damn it! Deceiver. Haunted. Alright, give him. Oh, ho, ho, ho. nice! Hmm. Okay, let's go for the shield. And one more. Let's go. That's blue. Echo. It's kind of cool, right? Echo. 11. I don't remember ex- Oh, yes. Hobgoblin. Weapon power. 200. But it needs 200. Physical defense. So if I go and... How can I easily convert Echo Fusion? No. Unequip. Can I go like this? Weapon power and crit rating. Nice. And um And now can I have something like smaller but still good? Yes. I certainly can. Good. So that that was really nice. Yeah, a lot of lot of flora that is poisoning us. Let's move through. Okay. <laughs> Let's move through and I'm running where I was before. Come on. I want that. Yes. There is a lot of things that is like hidden. So that's kind of nice that you can explore those dungeons. Broken. Let's let's deal with one and then we will go for the second. Mm. Shrike, you did. What is this? Uh, Grendel. We don't have the, the hero. Okay. Requires fuel, so we need to find fuel. Uh, is that a lootable? No, I don't think so. So where? There have to be, uh, there have to be a thing. Oh, we dying. Do we have it already? No, we don't. So we forget it somewhere? I think we will need the fuel to power on the, the thing, the, the machine. That's kind of weird. Hmm. On top? silo for that I could switch to silo to see the echo but yeah next time maybe I think we will encounter this this in the future again so I'm not sure where when exactly to get the thing oh here I can see that it's green from the poison drill fuel okay <laughs> So that's what it is. Oh, we get one, but we need... We got fuel, but we need something more. So I guess I missed the... The crate. That might be it. Because it was green from this, this poison, and I couldn't see it. So it wouldn't make sense it would be in this zone. Right? That is one chest. Like, have I met, like missed it so much? Like, it, it can't be like this. This is just... Refuel the drill. Like, what the hell? Alright, let's teleport. Right? Should be quick. Yes. 
Why it... Oh! Hmm. I thought I am uh, right into this. And it was not there before. At least I didn't... Didn't see that. Alright. So the drill is going through. And we got the new zone to explore. Okay, it's broken. We got the really good break damage with the axe. But the poison is kind of hindering us. Ooh. Nice. Okay, <laughs> it's just, they're just dropping on us. On the one way, it's good. Ow. Let's kill the goblins first. The poison is annoying. Ugh. Oh, he's still dropping from above. That's not smart, boys. That's not smart. Why? I don't know. Anything? No. Oh, there are more. Ouch. Okay, kill the small ones before I will engage the hobgoblin. Or whatever it is. You broken, bro. And you dead. Beautiful. We got another drill of uh, fuel. Money. Booming scarf. That's an artifact. Now refuel. Refill the fuel. And we moving forward. Can I pass this? Right. Can we go this way? Nope. That seems like a bad idea. What the? Oh, nice. That is a lot of enemies. Let's taunt them. Because it will give me uh, a life steal. Ouch. Okay. Mm. Kinda. A lot of them. How do we are slashing them to pieces? Let's go! Oh, the more. Oh, that's a new one, right? Oh my god. The dodge was crucial. Hmm. We went through his armor. Alright, we dodged. I enjoy that one. Oh! And we got him. Alright! Stormstrike Echo. So that's, that's really cool Echo. But we need to level up those things or get better ones before we will be able to use it. So that's, that's one thing. Oh, this is... That was super close. What do we have here? Can I destroy it? Nope. There is something. Oh my god, look at the chest. The chest looks absolutely fabulous. Overseer band, level 70 artifact. And maniac buddy. 
super nice. Let's go refuel the thing and we will change uh, things around in our inventory. Just, you know, be better. Because that's always a fun thing. Refuel the drill. You know the drill. Refuel the drill. Uh, character. And we get those, right? We get the uh, 83. Oh, we got quite good ones. So... Level 11. And you can, uh, like, miss, mix and match and do, like... Uh, do things with them, right? Like, uh, uh, what is that? Set. So, for example, this 11... Is the same uh, as I have already? Nope. But it's part of like... But it's so much better, right? Ability power, ma mag defense and weapon power. Let's do it. This is 9. I should go for something like 11, but we already have that. I think that's nice. For now. All right, let's move. Let's move. Okay, what do we have? Okay, there is something else. Oop. Thought maybe there was a hidden entrance to the different part. Ouch. I'm getting slapped by the poison. So much poison. A simple jar. Ah, quite a lot of loot. Oh, that's treasure chest. Some gold. Ooh. Skeleton key. New housing decoration. Nice. Yeah, you you got the whole housing system here. So that's that's kind of cool as well. Nice. That's a lot of damage. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay, we can detonate this. So, and we got Bloods Inspector. Nice. Some resources for upgrading and stuff. Yeah, what, what I like about the change to the single player kind of is <laughs> the grind is uh, is not there anymore kind of like is there right but it's not like mmo kind of well, grind because you fly. need the grind to uh, keep people engaged when it's single play it doesn't like it kind of doesn't make sense to make it uh, that grindy because you want to play through the experience and you can uh, you know because some of the things for example for the for the characters that was a grind right to get the characters so it, it's it's supposed to be, be like a floor frame, right? Where you everything you could potentially get through just playing the game, uh, but to get some of the characters and weapons and so on, you have to grind a lot. So uh, I think they 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 wanted to go for the same thing, right? They wanted to go for the absolutely the same thing as a Warframe. Uh, and a lot of people say the Warframe is like great, like uh, as a as a free-to-play game. It's just it's just fair. Oh no, because it's really not like the, I don't know. A lot of people say that the the, the Warframe is kind of cool as a free-to-play game. I don't know. I have not put uh, many hours into Warframe, so I can't say that's that's truth or not. But I heard a lot of people feeling about that. What is this? Oh, yeah, what's up? Any lucky to win game? All right, test your luck. What do we have? That's shame. Care to try again? I don't know what I'm doing. Do I need to hold it? Maybe. Oh. All right. I don't know what I'm losing. 
What? Nice! You win the prize! <laughs> but... Uh, I don't know what happened. Like... I don't know. <laughs> but we won the prize. Yay! We're lucky, I guess. Alright, let's go in. Let's go inside the area. Will it be cool or will not be cool? Who knows? Back to the dock. That will be small encounter. Alright, some, some some flyers. Let's go against the seers. Oh, that was... I didn't have to roll out because I killed the seer with it. Oh, they are casting those those uh, AoEs everywhere. We need to deal with that. Oh, yeah, we got this. Oh, yeah, but I'm still at the beginning, so the game is kind of not open yet. Oh, we got the big boy. Get behind me! Let's go for ultimate, because we will be uh, invulnerable and we will be able to smash through his shield easily. Oh no! <laughs> okay, beautiful. Oh, we are doing so much damage with the new new thing that we equipped. Yeah, <laughs> you don't understand a chance. All right, we got some some equipment. All right, Codex of Shadow Whisper and Skeleton Key. Those are good for the chest. But we got it. Let's go finish finish the job, and we can leave the gloom. Why would the Shrikes abandon this place? All right, we got something. Back to a haven so we can talk next steps. And we are out. But yeah, there, that, that's it for today. Hope you enjoyed the Wayfinder. Let me know down below in the comment section if you want to see me uh, play more or just make a like kind of playthrough of it. Yeah, let me know. The game is kind of like, it's fun. The, the combat is super neat. Like, uh, it's fluid. It's every, uh, everything you expect from um, from uh, action RPG, like uh, from the third person view. I feel that there will be a lot more to it, right? Because uh, the game will open up. Uh, like there will be more more possibilities to go and and harder like uh, challenges. Because you will scale up the dungeon because you will need to go uh, like oh my god, I'm poisoned and I'm dead. <laughs> the explosion kind of got me. Can I? Oh yes, I can actually. All right, but you can slay those guys, and yeah, it's kind of mix and match because you are going uh, um, through overworld, right? And you are unlocking new uh, uh, new dungeons. Crossroads Founder is a, another one, right? The pit is another one, and then you can, from the main hub, you can go into those dungeons, craft various of things that will like modify the dungeon and go for a higher difficulties, and you are just getting loot and you are changing your hero, and yeah, the character, right? So the, you have the accessories, you have the armor set, uh, and then you have the weapon that you can like upgrade, so you can like, um, you know, you get five stars. So we get we don't have any star and it will just add more stuff and more layers after that you will unlock those two things uh, that is they are locked one of them was in MMO before and you will specify what you want to go for for example you will go like weapon mastery so so you will have uh, stronger hits but or you will go crit chance for example for daggers or something and then uh, they added like whole new thing as a talent tree. And, uh, and there are another nodes that you can unlock and, uh, you know, specify what are you going for. And I think that's a Wayfinder rank. That's what uh, will allow it. That's what it unlock it. 
So, and yeah, and then you will level up also Wingrave and you will, you will awaken his levels. So, so there is quite a lot of systems and a lot of like layers on the game that you can go and delve into. And if you ma don't mind to like grind a little bit, go through the dungeons and, and just have action pack combat all the way. I think it's something for you and you should keep out on. Uh, like if you go to the steam and you can have it by uh, you can click on the description a uh, link in the description you will see that there is mixed reviews i think it, at least it was when i was recording this video and mostly it's about the people are pissed that the game was changed and i absolutely got it I, like i understand that uh, and, and, and the developers understand as well. It's just bad, yeah, right? <laughs> there is no other way to say about that. It's just not good, right? When you have some uh, something in mind, you want to do MMO, you will sell people MMO. You'll be like, yeah, this is MMO. And after a while, you'll say, yeah, it's not MMO anymore. There will be people that will be pissed. And I, un I completely understand. But I, I now get over that, and I am uh, I am just taking it as a, yeah, it's not MMO anymore. It's a it, it's a single player game or cop with you when you want to play with your friend, and it's a different different experience. But it's it's kind of it's cool. I don't know. So yeah, that's it. Thank you very much for being. Thank you for your time. Uh, if you want to check out more content, you can click on the videos about me. You will get something more. Or you can wait for another time and I will bring something else because I'm covering a lot of the games. If you don't want to miss out uh, on that, uh, you should click uh, the subscribe button because then there will be notifications that will let you know that there is a new video. And yeah, that's it. And if you're feeling really cool, you can uh, stop by on Thursday because I'm uh, streaming every Thursday on YouTube and Twitch. And you can hang out, you can talk, and you can ask me a question about anything you want. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Thank you very much, and I will see you next time. Peace.